Well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning, audience. We are loaded up and headed out and going on an adventure. Memphis is like, I am so ready. Kira, are you ready? You wanna go for a ride? Do you wanna go for a ride? All right, we're loaded. Everybody's ready. Mom and dad are over here. Let's get in the car and go. So first stop of the day, during a little bit more daylight, even though it's cloudy, we came back down to the Champion 4 mine shaft to check things out. All these old buildings. So I know we've said it in many videos in the past, but I know a lot of you are new as well. The Keweenaw is known as copper country because they used to do a lot of mining for copper up here. So a lot of these old abandoned mines are old copper mines and different ore mines. I think there's some silver mines up here as well. This one was a copper mine, right? I believe so. I yeah. think so. You checking it out? Checking it out? Mm -hmm. mm. Isn't that cool. Oh my goodness, what are you doing? Are you singing a song? Where do you want to go? Everywhere. I know there's your buddy. Hi, Andy. Whoa, check that out. How cool. I do love these old buildings. Well, I don't know what that is, but that's cool too. All right, so as always, if you guys would like to learn more about this, you can pause and read it here. And here's another sign you can pause and read. We made our donation. Pretty cool spot, huh? Yeah, it's definitely neat. Yeah. It'd be really neat if eventually they do like they said and maybe start restoring some more of these buildings and it'd be kind of cool. All right, girls, let's rock and roll. So we made it back to D Stadium, birthplace of professional hockey, and we went to go walk out here where we've walked many times and uh, they're working here. But look, this big boat, dredge and a tugboat just went under the bridge down there. Well, we normally walk this way to see the bridge, but we're gonna have to walk all the way around. That is really cool. And a little tugboat pushing it through the, the channel. So in case you don't remember it, that is the D Stadium, birthplace of professional hockey. So we're in Houghton. Oh, look at all those bicycle rims. <laughs> bicycle rim art. We're trying to make it to the bridge and there's only one lane open, so it's going a little slow, but that's okay. It gives us a chance to enjoy these buildings as we drive through. We're heading to the Quincy. There's a bunch of Huskies in the window. Mm -hmm. I always forget that it's the Michigan Tech Huskies. <laughs> you're, you're their mascot. So like, guys, I've got the best view ever up here. Here's the amazing lift bridge. Da, 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 da. We just saw it lift too. Yeah, we did. That was kind of neat. Big old bolt went under it. Oh, it looks like they're replacing their metal grating too. Ugh. Yeah, that doesn't look fun. They're just making it safer. <laughs> and now we're in the city of Hancock. So we made a stop at the Keweenaw Waterway Scenic Overlook. If you guys want to pause and read it. Not as pretty of a view as it used to be. They need to trim some trees. <laughs> so here's some more information on the Keweenaw Waterway if you guys want to pause it and read it. And that's basically what the other map showed, the waterway that runs through the middle of here and then the bridge and stuff is down there. And we're heading up there to Quincy Mine. There's the Quincy Mine. So there's a whole bunch of buildings here. There's actually a little museum down there. We are not gonna go down into the mine because uh, there's a long way down. It's also 43 degrees down there. But we are gonna go do the surface tour. We're gonna drive around some of these buildings and check them out. That's the mine shaft for the old Quincy mine. And then she was saying that's some type of pump house that pumped all the water out. She said that's like the largest still standing pump house or something. So there's the mine shaft. This is the hoist house. There's some old mine carts and then there's some old steam engine trains back here. We're gonna walk over here and see. Look at these old tracks. How cool is this? And these old carts back here. All right, let's go over by the trains. So these are old steam engines. Wow, so crazy. Some more old buildings back there. That's new stuff. <laughs> but these are old steam engines. They had to put coal in them and keep them going. That's pretty cool. As old as this is, see this valve? Yeah. You go in your house, you can't even turn a water valve. That's so crazy. <laughs> oh. the water in it, but still. Right. Yeah, these are pretty cool. Let's see if it's a flute. No. Nope. No, that one turns too. <laughs> how cool. After all that time. Yep. So we were looking at this track and how crazy this hill is. I don't know if the camera picks it up. I mean, you can clearly see up there that it's a hill. And here's some more of the old carts that they would load up. So I think this would go down to the hill and then that mining thing that we saw across the river down there is where all of this stuff would go to at the bottom of this hill. So here we are downtown Calumet 
See where the old signs were this in the buildings? This is where that big fire was. This oh. is where all those buildings burned down. Oh. They lost everything right here. I, but think, I think we parked in one of those parking lots once. I think we did too. The road is a brick road. I don't know if you can hear that echoing. <laughs> the home? Yeah. The buildings down here are just so cool. Look at this one. Look at all yeah. of them. And they're restoring it too. That is so cool. I'm looking for the Fireman's Museum. Oh, I, I think, yeah, think I think it was down there. there. I, that's yep, right. Yep. There's the heritage yep. house. So we'll okay. go this way and go around. And then we'll whip around. Okay. Yeah. yeah, it's very cool. That says 1900 circa. Yeah, big old mining town. Yeah. This is one of the bigger ones up here. Yeah. So of all the times we've been up here, the Firefighter Museum has not been open. As if, and as you guys know, my grandfather was a Detroit fireman. So we've always wanted to come in here. So we're gonna come in here and check it all out. 1919 fire truck, look at these. And some of these are the old fire trucks that were collected from some of these cities. So this city is not far from here. That's their one of their fire trucks. So cool, look at this one. Oh man, here's the one right here. Look at this. It's a fire sled. My dogs could pull that. Totally, totally. They got old hoses back here. Okay, this is totally worth it. This is so cool. I gave them some extra money for a donation as well. Look at this. Oh, this stuff is so cool. Italian Hall. So here, I'll stand here. If you guys want to pause it and read it. Atlantic Mine Pumper oh, from 1857. So this was a pumper from the mine. All the old hoses and fire trucks. Check this out. I'd take this for my front yard. As creepy as it is, I really would. This is a funeral wagon for those of you that may not know. So if you guys don't know about the Italian Hall tragedy, that was the green sign that I just uh, showed you. It's sad, but search it on the internet. It's crazy. That happened here. So much cool stuff. All right, so we climbed all them steps to come up here and check out all the stuff up here. Oh, check this out. It's a fire alarm transmitter. Man, this just goes on forever. On top of the fact that this is a really cool old building. This is the Italian Hall, so there it was. That's what it was. They tore it down in 1984 because of the tragedy that occurred there. So see this? That's, I think, the fire? No, maybe not. I don't know what that is. I don't think that's the Italian Hall, but whatever it is, it's tore down. No, it is. It was a fire, because you can see it right there. So. We came, again, wave. Jamie's in the car with the dogs. We came to take some pictures of this old cool church. There's also a train station over there. And it's open. So we're gonna take you guys inside. The, it is so beautiful. This is St. Paul the Apostle Roman Catholic Church. So here's some information on it if you guys wanna pause it and read it. It's so beautiful. Look at how the light comes through the stained glass. There's that pipe organ. That's gotta sound amazing in here. So cool. Absolutely beautiful. I love old architecture. This is just mind blowing. So we were talking about the Italian hall, the fire that wasn't a fire, where somebody yelled fire and there wasn't a fire. This is actually where it used to be. Here's the building itself. And you can see that archway door right there. That's the archway door right there. The only part of the building they left standing when they tore it down in 1984. And it was Christmas Eve. And then everybody's names are on the sign back there. What do you think, girls? They're like, I don't know, this is kind of sad. Here's some more info on it right here. Here's the other side of the sign so you can read the whole story. Yes, Look, we found a friend. I was filming my friend. He's my new friend. We're at the rock yeah, shop. That's, that's the... And I'm making everybody do the test. Yep. Find the agates. Yeah. Dad found one. Now you know what they look like. Yeah, this is Prospector's Rock Shop. That's just kind of... We came here yeah, last right? year. What do you think? It's an old girl. Hey, come here. Hey, hi. Come on. She probably can't hear me very well. She belongs to the people that owns the rock shop. <laughs> so everywhere we go, we're making doggy friends. Look at my dogs are like, um, excuse me, why are you petting that dog? Because, you know, we're good. You're good. So yeah, we're out here looking at all the outside rocks, and then we'll go inside. Jamie's checking out all the rocks. Look, you found True some of that. Light. Yep, that's what it's called. Yep. You found some of that. Serpentine. So many rocks. It's like 
rock heaven. A dollar for rocks. Or we could just go find our own. <laughs> I love how they got the squirt bottles out here. We found the rocks that make glitter. I don't think they actually make glitter, but there's glitter everywhere. How you doing, girls? Did you see that big shepherd? She was so pretty, wasn't she? They're like, well, how come we can't go in the rock shop? You can't go in the rock shop. I'm sorry. They don't allow dogs, except for their own dog. <laughs> Otherwise, I would totally take you in the rock shop. What do you think? They're like, this has been such a fun adventure so far. We'd go and do more stuff. We will. I even think we're gonna go to the lake in a little bit. What do you think of that? I have glitter on my hands from that rock. I don't know if you guys can actually see it, but it's there. Would you like it on you? Here you go. Now you got glitter in your fur. Now you're shiny. <laughs> Look at these rocks. Okay, yeah, here. Don't, don't worry, know. one person stay yeah, outside to watch the dogs. Like we don't see Euchre lights all the time. Yeah. Or ember lights. Mm -hmm. It's it's Let's a soda fill. light. Soda lights. But yeah, they even have the these. These are the bigger ones. How oh, cool. And there's a whole bunch back there. Great big ones. Oh right yeah, there. they sure are. Oh. Jeez, the beats. How cool. Whole big section of them. Yeah. Oh, that's Whoa. a different one. Oh, they're all fluorescent rocks though. Yeah. I forget what the green ones are. That's cool. So you guys saw it inside this place last year, I think, when we were here. But yeah, it's uh, it's pretty cool. And it goes on and on and on forever. The day of adventure isn't over yet. Coming up on the next video of Snow Dogs Vlogs. Oh look, it's just like a rock shop. Only free. Right. All right, girls. We're going into the woods here because I think we found something amazing. We're at Eagle River Falls. Snickers, if you don't jump, we won't make it. Don't forget to hit subscribe, click that bell to turn on all notifications, and if you would like to see more of our fun adventure videos, there will be some videos listed on the screen here. You can just click on them and go check them out. As always, you guys, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big, and we will see you in the next video.